Hey everyone, my name is Nishant Gupta and welcome to my YouTube channel. As you can see from the title of this video, yeah, I finally made it to IIM Shillong. Honestly, the feeling of making it into an IIM is so, so, so surreal. Uh, I don't even know how to express myself. Nine days ago, I got an offer letter from IIM Shillong and it's the 1st of June today. And in 17 days, I will be in campus at Shillong. And everything is moving so, so, so fast. I haven't had the time to actually just pause and look back at the amount of hard work that I have put over the past one year. In fact, um, as I'm recording this, um, I'm thinking about those late nights and those early mornings, the stress of completing that syllabus, um, the sadness that you get when you really mess up a mock, uh, the happiness you get when you get like 90 percentile above in a particular mock paper, um, the continuous monotonous process of studying and repeating that day in and day out, all for one particular examination that's CAT. This is something that all CAT aspirants have felt, this is something that all my colleagues or rather batchmates everybody who is going to be school this year has felt it's it's been a lot of hard work for all of us i'm sure that everything that happens happens for the good for my case honestly i did not expect to get into an iim if you asked me a year ago what's your dream college i did not have an answer for most it's the holy trinity i am abc i honestly did not have an answer i in my head i was like there's one examination, actually four or five, if you count the OMETs, ZAT and MATSNAP, etc. But there are a set of examinations that I need to really give my best, I need to ace. And whichever college that I get into will be the best college for me based upon my hard work. And so getting Shillong was a huge surprise indeed. In the midst of celebrating, uh, getting into an IIM, shopping for... Shillong because I am from Goa and I'm not used to the winters. I come from the beaches and I have to move to uh, the mountains. And uh, just the overall excitement of beginning the next phase of my life, I realized that this is the right time to pull out my camera, pull out my mic and just document my journey. And so what can you expect from this channel is kind of pretty simple, you know. I'll take you through my life in two years of I am Shillong as often as I can. I'll try vlogging, though I know that MBA is supposed to be extremely, extremely hectic. So no promises over there, but if I'm actually able to show you what life is at a B school, or at least try to do justice in showing you what life is at a B school, I will honestly try to do that. I've been thinking of getting my friends from other B schools, the other IIMs, XLRI, MDI, MICA and MIMS onto uh, this platform, just have an honest conversation with them throughout their preparation journey, um, their GDPI experiences and just pull out as much value as I can for those people aiming for those colleges. Honestly, the reason for starting this YouTube channel was to document my two years at I am Shillong so that when I am 29, 30, I can look back to when I was 24 and look at the experiences that I had in Shillong. I'll be going to Shillong in 17 days and amidst all the chaos, if I actually get time, hopefully, hopefully, hopefully I can record a few videos, maybe like a travel vlog of sorts. No promises, but I'll try to do it. Yeah. Um, but yeah, if you guys want to see what life um, at I am Shillong is like, what life in a B school is like, or if you just want to, you know, be a part of this journey, then don't forget to hit the subscribe button and yeah i'll see you guys uh, next week Bye -bye. yeah but with that i would like to say the most cliche thing that a youtuber would say please like please share please subscribe and don't forget to hit the bell icon oh god damn i'm a youtuber <laughs> but yeah um honestly please like please <laughs> I, I can't do this.